some of the plants that are used to attract the mullet from the hole. It smells nice for the mullet and it will just get in time to be caught. When now you want to trap a mullet, you use long sticks so uh, it will act as a river to remove the mullet from the hole. And this pair we normally go for such of the of the nice and heavy, nice and silver. Uh, six no ones to act as our river uh, to be used for trapping the mora. That's one. We use another one. This is how it's done. In the room, you just cut. This is another one. Another one. All these are our traps now. We're gonna use these ones to trap them. Okay. When trapping a murat, we normally long grass. This long grass will act as our our string when trapping the murat. We are going to look for the hole over here. Cut. Very interesting young man. American creatures located in Nakuru. As you can see, all those are geothermal stations. They are trying to harvest electricity through the geothermal process. Which one can I use? Let me try with this one. Let me try with this one. For now. This is a fresh mole lat here. It has a fingers bar up. The hole is here. I have found the hole. This is the hole. What I use when trapping a mullet is these wires. These copper tactile wires. They are the ones to get hold or to get hold of the rodent from the hole. We're gonna hinge it on the on the tree on the long stick. We are going to make a good. We are going to make a nose through here, through the wire, and the size should be the size of the hole. We're gonna make the nose of the size of our mullet. This is how we shall do. Done. We're gonna use our long grass. 
the long grass we harvest this one. We're gonna use the long grass. We're gonna use this wire. We're gonna use also these plants that make it easier for the Lord to come in. And again, we're gonna use this gonna use this short stick also. Now what all this what we need to get our out. Now the position the first thing we are doing now we are gonna start by putting our copper wire with a snake that has a snake. Now After putting that small hole, you see the distance. The distance now. Now we bring in our wire, the nosed one. The size should be of the hole. You see, this is the size of the hole. Now we put it in front by this position. Now. This is where everything, or this is where the cooking starts of the hole now we're gonna pull it slowly slowly in the hole we're gonna just pull it slowly slow slow we put the nose oh, come on come this side okay nice go nicely we just put the size of the hole to the nose. You see? And let it stick to the sides. The walls. Let it stick inside the walls of the hole. Making sure that when the Lord end come, it will not fill the wire. So you have to be very careful for the Lord and not to realize or to temper with the wire. So you just hinge it nicely, nicely to the walls of the... By this hole now, we're going to put this soil underneath to block the hole where the wire is passing the hole where the wire is passing and on top here we just cover it with the soil this is the way Now, now, the wire now is now holding or going round the hole nicely and making sure that when the lorry come, it won't feel anything by the side of that wire. We're gonna just cut it by the side. The stick at the middle to hinge our long grass in here. Our long grass will be hinged over here. We just put it over in this position only to attract or just make it just stick. And that's it. We just push it in the hole. Here is our hammer. We will knock down our strong stick. stick. Everything matters. And the chemistry is over here now. You hinge down our 
see but the position you have to mark the position of the wire the nose and the long string then we knock down our small stick down light to the at the middle of the hole at the middle of the hole and this is how it will act or this is how it is make sure that everything is intact the rodent will come pass it will have pass inside the snare in the wire come and cut this glass over here after cutting the glass it will have to be lifted up out of the hole cut as you see this string will carry the weight or the strength of this stick after bending it so we shan't tamper with we will not tamper with the wire or the snare in front what will carry all the weight is this chain, as you see. But put it down, just get it now, just nicely measuring for the distance of everything. You see, this is the position. We're gonna use it that way. You just put it inside nicely in the soil in the ground and it should be in line it has to be in line all are in line the long glass and again the wire they have to be in line then we bend we make sure that it is stuck nicely inside the soil inside the soil from there you come you see the position of the wire now we just bend it slowly we bend our wire slowly we bend our stick slowly nicely nicely we bend it nicely it is the one carrying the weight we have not tied the wire you see the wire is loose now this, this stick or this glass will carry the weight or the tension of this. Then tie it nicely. Tie it nicely. Tie it nicely. Tie it nicely. now you see the tension of our long stick bending all the weight now hinged from the small from the small hinged from the small stick we use now the wire is over here now the nose now we part we cut we put round our nose now or the wire to the the stick the long stick nicely nicely and all is done now okay what will happen now the lord it will come pass through the nose of this wire come and cut this long grass which is hitched to the the stick now now we have to use a bite. This is our bite now. Okay, we just put it beside the hole. You see? Not very close to the hole. You just put your bite by the hole. Yeah. Turn the soil back to the position it was initially. You see? 
The magic is done. Oh, the tension now. You see, this is where everything is. The tension. When the rodent will be out, this one will be loose and this one will be tight. And the position of the monster will have changed. See the distance from this position to here of the stick. But after the rodent will come, you will see the position will change. Good luck. We wait for a few minutes, only a few minutes, and the rodent will be out. Is here. Our rodent is down here. Now, all the weight, all the weight is by the wire. You see, our it has already cut the long grass. You see the position now. From the ground to the position, our rodent is here now. It's up, and we're gonna hook out this rodent by removing the stuff. Slow, slow. Our rodent is here. Our rodent is here, hooked by the side of the pole. Our rodent is here. Our rodent is here, hooked. You see the poor rodent. You see how it is hitched. Does it? This is the poor thing now. This is now the rodent. It is hitched of the nose by the by the neck of the rodent now. It has done the farmer a lot of bad things. And now all is done. Students put a lot of pleasure on farmers by destroying the yard homes. Everything. Now you see, you hear the sound. You hear the sound making the rodent a hissing sound. It makes a lot of calamity by eating farmers, plants, grass, making everything unmanageable. A small thing, more light, goes down in the barrels, eating the roots of my audience. Just subscribe more. You see, it has just taken two minutes to bring out the rodent from the hole, just subscribe more. Good luck. Yeah, the family is the family of rats. Is the family of the rats. Oh, yeah. 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 Oh,